Welcome everyone, you may be in a situation where you have forgotten the PIN or the passcode for your Samsung Galaxy Tab S8 series. You can see, mine says try again, whatever PIN or passcode I attempt, it will not allow me to unlock the tablet. So what I'm going to show you is how to regain access to your Samsung Galaxy Tab S8 series without the passcode. Now keep in mind, this tutorial only works if you are the owner of this tablet. So if you are planning on buying a Tab S8 series off of eBay, which uh, has a locked passcode, or let's say you've even stolen a Samsung Galaxy Tab S8, this tutorial will not work for you. It will become very clear why later on uh, in the video. However, if you own this tablet, then everything will work smoothly, no issues there. So the first step is we need to make sure that we connect our Samsung Galaxy Tab S8 to the computer. Now, when I mean a computer, I mean any Mac computer or any Windows computer. You may also get away with connecting your tablet to your phone as well. However, that is untested. Just make sure you get your charging cable, put the cord into the tablet, and then the other end into your computer. The reason why is because we have one your wife free and later, we will need to do this in order to enter recovery mode. So in order to enter recovery mode, once you have verified, you have connected your device to the computer, what we're gonna do is we're gonna do a key combination. So you can see at the top of the tablet, we have the power button. So when you click on the power button, you can see it shows the lock screen. So we're gonna uh, click and hold, so not click and release, click and hold on the power button and keep on holding on the volume down. We're gonna do this until the screen goes black. And once the screen goes black, we're going to release our finger from the volume down while keep on holding uh, power. We're gonna hold volume up. So I'm gonna walk it through step by step if that sounded a bit complicated. So first of all, what we're gonna do is I'm gonna put this on the uh, tripod here. So we're going to uh, go and we're gonna click and hold power and click and hold volume down at the same time. So three, two, one. So I'm holding these two down both. And I'm gonna keep on holding. I'm gonna keep on holding. And you just want to keep on holding until the screen goes black. One, two. And then we're going to click and hold the power and volume up. So we'll just keep on holding this. Do not release. You want to keep on holding until you're brought into the recovery mode. So we're now on the boot screen. Keep on holding. Do not release this entire time. And there we go. You can see once we're in this mode, we can now release off of the buttons. So you can see here we're in Android recovery. I'm going to focus the camera and zoom in. All right, so here's the deal, right? We have to navigate using the volume button. So volume up, we'll go up, volume down, we'll go down. And so what we need to do is we need to navigate to wipe data slash factory reset. You can see this one right here. And then click on the power button to select. So don't click and hold, click and release this time. So click and release. And then you're gonna see wipe all user data. This cannot be undone. You click on the volume down and then click on factory data reset. And so what this will do is it will completely erase all of the data on the internal storage. And that is the one caveat, which is that, you know, in order to erase the passcode, we have to erase all of the files at once. This will also erase all the files on the SD card. So if you want to keep the files on the SD card, make sure you eject that before proceeding with this step. And so we'll just click on factory data reset, and then you'll be brought back to the first screen you saw when you got your Samsung tablet. Now, here's one other thing you need to keep in mind is the reason why I said earlier this video, which you need to be the owner of this tablet in order to regain access is because it will ask you to enter in the username or password for your Google account. Of course, the only way you would know those details is if you were the previous owner, uh, do keep in mind, guys, that if you didn't use a Google account, then you don't need to worry about this. If you did use a Google account, you will need those login details available. So just click on the factory data reset. It will factory reset your tablet. And then once it's done, you'll be good to go. Set up your tablet like normal. Re-add a passcode, which hopefully you remember. And if you ever need to follow this guide again, of course, this video isn't going anywhere. So that's all there is to it. Thanks for watching. See you guys later. Bye-bye.